sun moon and rising sign this is the energy vibration for the layer sun moon and rising sign I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for the wonderful um, support likes and shares I want to say to all you Leo's thank you for the wonderful support and I want to say to each and every person thank you um, this week is from the 19th until the 25th and in this week happy Thanksgiving happy Thanksgiving to everyone out there I also uh, it's the fourth week of November and um, it is the week of uh, the devil so it's going to help you guys and the zodiac energy of water let's see what's happening for you Leo's on Monday you have um, the energy of the eye princess so um, listen to your intuition about a situation there was um, um, listen and stop worry listen to your intuition about a situation a situation to do with the organization a situation to do with the organization listen to your own intuition okay what is so good what I can already see is all um, the nine of swords that the worries um, and the ten of swords the lies and deception about our organization so um, some of you were worried about a situation and some of you was uh, uh, seen the lies and deception about our organization okay then on Friday the king of swords comes up some of you could be dealing with a legal situation or an Aquarian Gemini or Libra a Saturday you have the nine of cups your wishes and dreams are going to be coming out and Sunday this is a powerful weekend because it's good some of you are going to be aligning with the right um, relationship um, okay some of you are going to be aligning with the right relationship some of you could be connecting with someone who is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius a man uh, um, no, an Aquarius Gemini or a Sagittarian man. This you can see. Okay, now whatever is happening, um, uh, Monday is the energy of a water energy. It's all about secrets, deception, and it, you could be dealing with someone who is an Aquarius Gemini or Libra. This secrets and deception as lies and deceive, um, but also worries that this person was affecting your life. Okay, now as you look. Um, in a week whatever the lies and deception it's going to be and whatever the worries is no more because your win your wishes and dreams are going to be coming through with an organization so um, this is going to be working for you in your favor um, whatever is happening for you Leah's um, whatever deceptions that has happened um, it's going to be working out for you Leah's okay so the worries that you have over organization you're going to be coming out on top as we look some of you are dealing with an organization you could um, realize that you work for organization and you come behind and the lies and deception about this organization it's going to be coming out and you're going to be damn I don't know all of that was going on okay you Liz it's as if wow I didn't even know all of that was going on so um you Leah's um, are going to be really really seen let's look and see because there are some secrets so someone is keeping some secrets who is an Aquarius Gemini or Libra four to five years and older so if you're in a relationship with this person um, I, you know you were worried about this person yes you have all right to worry it um, but now you don't have to worry because whatever is happening is coming out okay Monday going into Tuesday there could be some message that is coming in it could be a message from about a child that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius, which it could be your child. But uh, and listen to your intuition about the situation. Listen to you, your intuition about the message that is coming to you. Now, um, there is a situation where um, if your child is a, um, between the ages of 15 and 45 and is a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion, um, he's bringing some message. But listen to your own intuition about this. Um, okay because all right um, um, Tuesday going into Wednesday um, there is some burdens there is some message that is coming in about some burdens or some burdens some situation whatever is happening Wednesday going into Thursday nine of swords so it's all about the nine energy nine of swords but it's in reverse both of your nine of swords is in reverse so this is good so release yourself from the worries that you have and the burdens okay 
um, some of you were carrying a burden with the organization relief yourself from the worries that you have or this situation okay leave whatever is happening leave um, if you feel as if someone isn't being very honest um, you are there especially um, this week is a positive week for the people um, between the ages of 15 and 45 it's a positive week especially in the weekend between the age of 15 and 45 it could be affecting everyone this weekend is a powerful weekend for connecting with new love I'm seeing the people who are looking for new love in this weekend you are going to be meeting the love of your life um, because the nine of cups your wishes and dreams is coming true um, three times nine nine of cups nine of swords nine of swords so something dramatic is about to end in your life and something new is about to start in your life okay new relationships are coming up um, you can um, see these new relationships coming up there or positive relationships that is coming up now some of you are dealing with an um some of you um are dealing with um uh, uh someone who is an aquarius gemini aquarius gemini or libra and your intuition is that you're receiving message about this person you are right let this relationship go you are receiving um you are receiving um words over this person um information over this person let this relationship go okay listen to your intuition and let this relationship go okay um whoever this person is let this relationship go okay um as we move forward um and yeah let this relationship go as we move forward we're looking at the swords the nine of swords in reverse and this is so good because whatever your worries was over our organization there is no need to worry okay because the lies and the deception whatever lies and deception that was plain is now open that means it's coming out okay and if you look he look and see especially in the weekend a lot of people are, are going to be happy because if you notice all these heavy energies um, they're all in the reverse these all these heavy heaven energies are in reverse because you have the nine of swords and the ten of swords and you have the nine of swords again here but you have the nine of cups in upright so it's going to be a positive week because all of this worries is over all of this worries over burdensome situation with someone who is uh, between the age of 15 and 45 you're seeing that this is ending okay this has ended so listen to your intuition if you receive a message you're in a relationship with an Aquarius Gemini or Libra and you receive a message um, end it end it end it end it and move forward there was some really deceptive things but um, whatever the lies was they're out there whatever the lies and whatever was plain they're out now so um, you can let go of uh, that situation Alrighty, so let's see what is happening. Some of you were dealing with a friend, a so-called friend, and this per person was an older person, um, and it could be your father, and um, is he was very deceptive. But information is coming out now. Don't have any contact with this person. Um, it's a false friend. Okay, it's a false friend. Um, some of you are going to be connecting with the right people. I'm seeing someone new coming in, especially in love. Some of you could be have could have had a good friend, and then you are going to be realizing that you know I've always loved this person. This is the love of my life. Some of you are organization. You're going to be fit perfect with an organization. Okay, so if you were looking for work, you are going to be fitting perfect for an organization. What I'm seeing here is whatever lies and deception. Some of you who are, could be getting divorced. I, I'm seeing an end. Some of you could be getting divorced. I'm seeing an end coming in. Um, if you had a relationship with an organization or so, um, I'm seeing that ending coming in, but I'm seeing a, 
um, it is a form of divorce the ending the ending of the ring um, divorce some of you um, who have a good good friend um, this um, there could be an end to a relationship some of you have a soulmate and whoever the soulmate is there could be an ending with this soulmate this person okay so be aware of that and don't worry about it because endings needs to come in okay endings needs to come in manifestation and focus on the vision beyond yourself and your unicorn will bring it to you focus on the vision beyond yourself and the unicorn will bring it in for you okay so whoever you are focus on a vision beyond yourself and the unicorns will bring it in for you some of you um i could have had um a good friend um this could be a business friend or whatever and this relationship could be coming to an end and it's okay what i'm seeing here is that some of you um, I have a situation with someone between the ages of um, 15 and 45. Um, it's a karmatic relationship. Uh, you two are soulmates and twin flame. Okay, so here it is. Um, you guys, um, whoever is um, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion, this could come in as a kid. A Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion, this could come in as a kid. Um, it's coming from a past life. The 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 wheel of fortune. You two could come from a past life, whether it's your partner or it's your children. Uh, this could be coming in from a past life, and you two are meant to be. You two are meant to be. Okay, you two are really meant to be. Okay, you two are really meant to be. Um, yep. Okay, so there is an ending that is coming to a situation. Some of you, um, it could be a job coming to an end, and it's going to be good because something new is going to be coming in because we have the energy of the organization here. It could be people who are working um, with an organization or in an organization or in a group, and there was some deception and lie. This deception and lie is over, and it's coming to an end, okay? Um some of you who are lovers or um, married, your marriage could be coming to an end. Okay, so maybe you are living together, not married, but um, it looks like as if you are married. Um, some of you who are married, your relationship is coming to an end. Some of you could be landing a good contract. Take it, run with it. It's gonna make you're gonna be a very successful. So some of you could be landing a good contract. Take it, run with it, because it's gonna be very successful. Okay. So positive um, week situation that is going on. So some of you who have been or have someone who um, these are positive um, situation that is going on. So um, yeah, that is good. Ladies and gentlemen, the full moon reading is out. Please go and download the fire. You guys are Leos, the fire. Um, so go and, and download um, the fire energies um, for you guys because this is what is going to be affecting you guys. You are the element of fire, the element of fire, the moon. Um, supports you and go and download the, the fire energy or listen to the fire energy full moon reading because there is so much information that is behind there okay so um, this is good I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back namaste until next time